So tonight you're going to be singing? Yes, yeah, some original music for you. It's a song that I wrote for my son. You wrote a song for your son? Yes. Oh, that's wonderful. I know, it means a lot to me. Like, I had lost him to cancer about a year and a half oh, ago. Oh, I'm so sorry. Tonight I'm going to be performing an original song, and it's a song that I wrote for my son. The one thing I always wanted to put in my son's mind was that no matter what happens in the world, know the joy of love, because the world doesn't need any more hate in it. He was, a, he was definitely a character, and um, he was spitting an image of me. I lost him to rhabdomyosarcoma. It's a, it's a, it's a lymph node um, cancer, and um, he passed away on his fifth birthday. And uh, it's been a couple of rough years. It's nothing like knowing that, like, what you love in your life isn't isn't always going to be there anymore. Being able to do this right here, I think that it makes him smile. Obviously, you've gone through a lot of turmoil. And I, I wish you all the best. Thank you so much. This song's called That's Love. I take a trip down memory lane, the battle point when I was 16. I'm on the cold old slinging rock, skipping on the stones, but they wouldn't even up my pop. It's all the stones that I've skipped, all the points of life that I've missed out on. But one thing you can't take away is something that I'll always be there, even on a rainy day. That's a love. I said, oh, yeah, that's a love. Death can kill, would never dies. Love is always hidden in your eyes. People got money and they're satisfied. I got one thing that money couldn't buy. It's love. Well, I said, oh, yeah, that's a love. Well, eight pounds, six ounces, is such a small thing Doesn't even know it's got the whole world to see You don't even know you've got a lot of air to breathe You even got a lot more people to greet But see the side of publicity and fame You got one thing that'll put it all to shame And that's love, I want you to scream it out loud, son Scream it out loud to the whole crowd So take the sigh from my eyes Take back all the tears that I've cried Leave me poor as a bum, but I will still be satisfied with love well, I said, oh, yeah, with the love, oh, oh, well, yeah, that's love. I'm speechless uh, when you told us your story and, and, and then you sing that song there is nothing more moving nothing that uh, tugged at my heart more than I no other song than what you sang the way you sang it coming from you having to deal with what you deal with so thank you, thank so you. Much. Heidi well, it, it made me very emotional. I am a mother of four children, so I can't even imagine um, how you feel. I want to thank you for sharing this with us, and I thought it was beautiful. Mel B. You really do have something special. You could actually hear a pin drop. Everyone was like hanging on your every word, and to be able to command an audience like that is something about you. There really is. Howard? Yeah, you're a real artist. There was nothing phony about that. That was real from the heart. And I felt not only are you a great songwriter, you have an exceptional sound and a way of phrasing a song. I, I was quite moved by it, and I find you an inspiration, so thank you. Thank you so much. All right. You know, uh, you wrote, the song is about love, undying love. And regardless of whether you pass from this world into the next, you know, we all have children here and you know no love stronger than a parent has for a child. And you're right, 
nothing could take that away. And I feel the energy of your child um, with, with you here and amongst us. And the love is spread throughout this panel and this whole room. And we would all love to say, yes. Yes. Thank y'all so much. You're trying to break into another world.